Mark Farner is a world-renowned guitarist and founding member of the legendary rock band Grand Funk Railroad. In the 1970s, as the band's songwriter, vocalist, and guitarist, he helped them sell over 30 million records with hit songs like We're an American Band, The Locomotion, Some Kind of Wonderful, and many, many more. Grand Funk was one of my favorite bands back when I had hair to my shoulder. I really did. And if I could grow it like that, I'd still have it today, I tell you now. <laughs> anyway, after 50 plus years, Mark is still on a global crusade for love, freedom, and rock and roll. Would you help me welcome Mark Farner? So good to have you back, Mark. Welcome. It is so good to be sucking air in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, there's a lot of people in America, that's about all they've done for the past year. It's been I a tough, that. tough time. <laughs> but you have been, uh, I, I mean, one of the things that I want to mention, your project from Chile with Love, you did a huge concert at a time when people just don't get to do concerts, huh? Yeah, uh, that was, you know, kind of a last minute thing. We had booked a tour down into, uh, from Peru to Brazil yeah. up to Chile. And the promoter in Chile, uh, Carlos Bastin, said, my friend is uh, from Abismo Films. He wants to shoot, got eight cameras. And uh, he said the magic words. He said, we're going to make you such a deal. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Gonna make you an offer you couldn't refuse, <laughs> That's huh? That's right. <laughs> well, I'm glad you didn't refuse it because it's a, a phenomenal 16 live performances, a bunch of bonus tracks on here. Yeah. You know, I'm amazed. 50 years, you're still rocking and rolling and having fun. <laughs> yes, I am. I mean, that's, that's a great you. legacy. Did you think you would be doing this 50 years later when you guys first started with Grand Funk? There was no such thing as classic rock radio, brother. Yeah. I mean, I didn't know. Yeah. How was you to know? I mean, we just thought we're just going to rock until one day, you know, uh, we wake up and, hey, where are we? <laughs> you know, I, I read, because I was a big fan. I mean, I really was. That's not just talk. You guys I sold out that, Shea bro. Stadium in less than 72 hours. The Beatles didn't even do that. That's right. I mean, that was a heyday of, of rock and roll. And you were innovators in a way that most bands didn't. Just and, weren't doing. And that was before there was any online ticket sales. Brother, yeah. there were people sleeping out on the lawn of Shea Stadium. We got pictures of, you know, the tents and the people. All 55,000 seats had to be bought at that ticket office. Hmm. It happened in 71 hours. That's incredible. Yeah. Now, there's something a lot of people may not know about you. You are one of the nation's most ardent supporters of our veterans. Well, thank you. And, and I, I don't think a lot of people know Mark Farner loves our veterans. Maybe because your dad was one in World War II. Yeah, tank driver in the 7th Armored Division. And he came home with four bronze stars, lived through four major battles. And my mother was the first woman in the United States to weld on Sherman tanks at Fisher Body in Flint, Michigan. How about that? Yeah. I mean, that's a legacy. Yeah. You know... Because of that, you've had some incredible moments, one of which was playing a concert at the Vietnam Memorial Wall. Yes. The veterans themselves told you that your song, I'm Your Captain, Closer to Home, was like their theme song. Yep. And they embraced it as something that, that spoke to them deeply. That's right. And when Keith King uh, from the Vietnam Veterans of America asked me to come and just bring a acoustic guitar and sing my song, I said, just my song? Yeah, he says that we, we voted and your, your song is number one. I said, well, are you gonna have a stage and lights and PA? Oh yeah, we're gonna have that. I said, well, what we'll do is we'll put the band in a bus and we will be here and do you an entire show for the, all the Vietnam veterans and we'll put Closer to Home on the end. It was 36 degrees that day. <laughs> we was warming our hands up on the light bulbs around the dressing room mirror, <laughs> you know, in this trailer. Uh, but when it came down to it, and we played the song, not only our brothers and sisters from America, but our brothers and sisters from Canada were there, our Canadian Vietnam veterans, and the eyes were just running, the, the tears came rolling, and uh, 
It was hard to sing the song. You know, it's like trying to sing with a softball stuck in your throat. I can't even begin to imagine. One of the things I think is pretty important, some of the proceeds from the sale of this DVD goes to the uh, Veterans Support Foundation. So people not only get some phenomenal music from Mark Farner, but they actually can help veterans at the same time they're doing that. That's right. My wife, Lisa, and I said uh, we're going to take uh, $3 from each one of these that sell for $14.99. $14.99 is such a deal. 16 yeah. tracks, two, two bonus videos, and five bonus songs that had never been released before. It's a great deal. So $3 for our veterans. And they said, well, we'll just do that on, on the uh, pre-sales. And I said, no, we won't. We're going to do it on every daggone one that sells. Uh, our troops are worth it. God bless you. You're a great American, a phenomenal songwriter, guitar player, and just a great guy. And we're so thrilled to have you here, Mark. And thank, thank you, brother. Thank you for coming. I think we probably ought to do some music, but I got to tell the folks, to get your copy of Mark Farner's American Band from Chile with Love. It's a live concert DVD as well as part of all of his great music. Go to his website, real simple, markfarner.com.